I know as a potential client, when you first interviewed me about, well, you know, what, what do I need from all my devices? That was exactly the point. It's like, well, I've got, like I said, five years of Fitbit data. I have my ordering. I've got my, you know, X, Y, and Z different products, and they've got all this data, but I don't know what to do with it. You right. know, tell me what I need to do or what I need to change. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you what my goals are. You help me, like, accomplish those. Because right now I'm just looking at the screen and seeing, like, how long I slept and how many steps I took and what is it, whatever, right? So and that's really what AIM7 well, aims to do, right, mm-hmm. is to aggregate all of that into something and, and, and give you more coaching uh, based on what you're seeing. Mm-hmm. 100%. So we do that with mind, body, and recovery. So the, the three big things, we kind of do this from an acute and a long-term standpoint. Every day we can provide you with a precise type, intensity, and duration of exercise your body is ready to adapt to. From a 30,000 foot perspective, what we're teaching people how to do is to build that capacity to adapt to more physical and psychological stress. And there's five pillars to do that. Sleep, exercise, mental fitness, nutrition, and healthy relationships. The scientific literature is very clear. Those things increase our resilience and longevity and health and lifespan. So what we do is we're like, okay, you like to do these things? Uh, Like to do the elliptical or a HIIT program or yoga. This is the one you should do today this hard, this long. Then from a mental fitness perspective, it's like, oh, you're stressed? Use a specific breathwork tool. Oh, your mood's down? Use a specific gratitude intervention because we know what those things do. And then from sleep, going back to our conversation, we look at like, is your duration off, timing off, consistency off, and then our algorithms nudge people into the right locations. And, and then from a chronic standpoint, a long-term perspective, after a week, we analyze your data and we're like, here's where you should start mind-body recovery. Because research demonstrates, there's a paper on the frontiers of physiology that showed these devices do not change long-term health outcomes. Right. It was done with aura rings. Very well, very well conducted study. But what does, the devices are good to track, right? But you need a goal, you need real-time feedback, you need uh, encouragement and you need education. We'd already built our model and, and this came out in 2022. All of that is in our app. And so how did we know? We, we pattern matched and then it was nice the scientific literature validated it. So we built a really unique behavior design model with um, the former senior sports psychologist from the US Olympics. We are rapidly expanding right now. We have some of the best in the world that you don't even know this. Uh, Dr. Alex Arbach, head of wellness development for the Raptors, just joined. Former head of sports nutrition for the New York Giants just joined Pratik Patel. It is like exploding. 